Alright guys, what's up everybody? So we're watching Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 2 now. Um, last week we ended off with like the confrontation with Levi and Kenny, and it seems like Kenny's guys are with him, and they're trying to... Levi's gang and stuff are undergoing a, an operation at the moment, so it's like... Situation's pretty hectic at the moment, honestly, and I'm just so excited to see how that's gonna go down, like... I, I'm not even gonna say anything except that I'm just so hyped like this show hypes me up all the time and that cliffhanger was serious So guys, let's just get straight into it Ooh, I'm so excited <laughs> Like he looks really like anxious. Like he's like, oh my gosh, damn, oh, yo, pain. It's titled pain. Like I need any more of that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Shouldn't he have pulled that out like as quick as he could, or was he like not able to? Did they kill him? Where's Nika? Okay, we, we got Levi in here. But we need some Nika sign this too. She is not gonna take any of this. Oh my god, I love when they're using the gear. They're just like swerving through the. Yo, what a vibe! <laughs> Yo! Yo, that is so badass! <laughs> wow, why are they on such bad terms right now? Like, my heart is pounding. That scene was just so epic. That's nice. Why do I like that? He didn't even flinch. In case everyone's wondering, I did see the OVAs. So. Oh my gosh! <laughs> This girl was like, oh my gosh. Yo. Levi is next level badass. It's insane. Mika saw we need you up in there. <laughs> the answer would be you not answering. He's still after them though, I swear. <laughs> See, this is why I love him, okay? Some people were saying like, he's an asshole, why do you like him so much? Honey! <laughs> She's not playing. That's Eden. Okay. Aww. She's hesitating. Please don't do that and stupid to me. Come on, don't. What was that? Yeah, no doubt. お前と話したいと思ってる。思い出話に付き合う気はないぞ。それないね、ライト。一緒に調査兵団を志したなかだ。<笑> 
<laughs> Eddie, my money will get it. Eddie's been feeling very sketch lately, okay? Ever since my last season. He killed someone? Is that why he's throwing up? Oh, because I had to see her little arm and shoot somebody. That would be so heartbreaking for me. I'd be like, no. Levi protected them and they ended up taking them. That's a crazy way to think about it. But it makes sense in his position to have shot him like really fast. Damn. <laughs> Why would he embrace it? <laughs> あ、だったのは俺でした。強く必ず打ちます。何が本当に正しいかなんて俺は言ってない。そんなことはわからないからな。お前は本当に間違っていたのか。ウェイ、ヒルスタイヒハディアニシエルヒルスタイヒフィギ
Wait, that's him who? Like, who is he exactly? Like, oh my god, I think I missed something. Who exactly is he? Well, they're with him, but who exactly is he? This ending song is so creepy. And then, do you see the Titans? Whenever they put, like, kid angelic voices in very, like, vulgar, violent situations, it's creepy. Okay, moving on. Preview. Okay. Okay, so it seems like we're gonna get like a backstory next week. Like a flashback of some sort with like Edwin's life and probably a bit about Astoria. Um, this? This anime is incredible. I'm sorry. I say that like all the time and I'm probably going to repeat myself a million times more, but it's just so good. It's so good. Everything is just so perfectly satisfying. The story, the animation, and the art style. That's the first thing that in my opinion just captivates me. It has like warmer tones. <laughs> this is what I pay. I'm an artist, so I kind of pay attention to that. <laughs> It has like these warm tones mixed with dark lining and just looking at it is just so you really feel like this world is real you feel connected to it more with that I don't know it's just for me it's just very captivating as opposed to like the regular anime where like the colors are, are like you know colorful or like the same like this one's just very it has a natural vibe to it and I I'm living for it um I love so much the pacing of the show too. I feel like it's doing good this season. The pacing is in my I think it's going pretty good. You could see that like the Titans are kind of taking a back seat, which is a hundred percent fine. Like we've had enough Titans from season one to season two. That's a lot of Titans, okay? So I'm alright taking a break from those Titans. Um so now we're we're seeing like kind of like what's going on with humanity itself. Um, what's going on on the inside and what's so ridiculous is how it continues to show us what people are like these people are all facing the same enemy in life like the titans are out there to murder all of them like they, they are literally facing the same enemy yet they're still fighting among each other they're still killing each other and this is like showing us the rawest form of humanity these people are doing everything they can to survive humans want to survive yet we're we're also just killing each other because of some type of personal gains that we want or just our own ideals and views and all that it's just absolutely ridiculous but that's humanity so it's really portraying that very well it was very sad, in my opinion, to see Armin kind of, like, enter a whole new, kind of, like, a new mindset. Like, his life, the moment he pulled that trigger in his head has changed. He sees himself differently, and he sees life differently. And Armin, I mean, Armin's always been, like, the crybaby good boy. He gets down to business when he has to, as you can see. This is a prime example. Um, he gets down to business, but, like, he, he still, in his heart, was, like, such a gentle person but um now i think he's come to acknowledge a new side of him which is a little sad um <laughs> levi the torture was just funny to me i don't know why <laughs> it just seemed like out of character yet he was so in character like do you see what i mean he had his gloves he had his apron and he was just calm face like all right we're gonna do this but <laughs> it also seemed like it was just not really his thing either <laughs> That was funny. I felt bad that the merchant guy died. I mean, I f obviously, like, in the first season, I definitely did not like him. I was like, what are you doing? Like, let these people through, you jerk. But, uh, I, I mean, I don't really like him either now. It's not like I know much about him more. It's just he, like, trusted Levi's group, and in the end, he's, like, got killed. I find that sucks. Um, and now the son is going to be the one, I'm sure, that's going to pass on the message. But, like, he's... Imagine being in the son's position. Like, oh, my gosh, they just slit your daddy's throat, and now you have to, like sneak away like <laughs> this is intense but yeah also what i said about like the titans not being in the story at the moment and it's mostly focusing on humanity on the inside i'm sure we're gonna get some epic titan stuff later to be very honest this is also gonna be 24 episodes unlike last season which was like dry because of that um this is gonna be like more episodes just like season one 
and I'm so hyped to see it because like if they're putting the Titans on the back seat right now we're probably gonna get some really good good stuff later no spoiling guys but that's really what I think um I don't know what else to say right now that was that was just a really good episode and next week I guess we're looking forward to some flashbacks and some stories about some some of the characters like Edwin and Historia so I'm excited to see that thanks a lot guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video leave your thoughts down below and I'll see you guys again soon thanks a lot and bye